several Tallahassee trainers are teaming up in a new partnership today to help you find the best fit for your year round fitness needs. And joining us this morning to tell us all about it is Keyshawn Frazier of Kings and Queens Fitness and Friends. We've got James West, who's also there. And I'm going to let the other two in the back introduce yourselves, if you don't mind. I'm Coach Key with Key Fitness. And I am Ivy. I represent the board for this organization. Awesome. So we've got just a small sampling here of all of the trainers who are going to be participating in this community event that you guys are launching today. Tallahassee Trainers Foundation. Tell me a little bit about why you felt the need to put this together and how many trainers are participating. Well, um, we decided to do something positive here in the community uh, just by bringing everyone together. And at this event, we will have at least 18 trainers uh, to come out and show some love and support and uh, give great energy to the community. We're going to give you some details about the event coming up in just a second. But according to the Disease uh, Centers for Disease Control, they have a national health statistic report that they release each year, and they did one uh, in June of last year. According to that report, obesity was the most common among non-Hispanic black adults. So I want to know from you guys what role you see this partnership playing in changing that statistic for minority communities in Tallahassee. Well, we want to uh, provide the community and surrounding areas with uh, education, which is big, uh, what we need, and also fitness, and also a facility um, that will be able to provide resources and things that people will need in order to live a healthy lifestyle and enhance their quality of life. Um, we take passion into this. Each one of the trainers um, are passionate in the, health, in the area of fitness. And we want to provide the community with that same thing. That's one thing that's uh, we have business owners. We have all uh, we have different kind of you know people with different statuses. And regardless of your status, we want to be able to be that intergener intergenerational hub for all people, regardless of your ability to pay or your ability, uh, or anything like that. So we want to provide a community with the education and the fitness to be able to enhance their quality of life. Now, James, and some of the things that I was researching when I found out about this, I learned that you guys are uh, looking to have a holistic approach, so to speak. Uh, yes, ma'am. Well, and with 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 this with this foundation, it's going to give us that platform to be able to do what it is. We've been doing it for a while, but it give us the platform to do it on many other levels and provide other resources that we can grab and bring to the community to help everybody. So this is one thing that we are passionate about and excited about. This event is definitely the launch of our Tallahassee Trainers Foundation. All right, we only have a few seconds left, but we have to tell people about the Crunch and Brunch event that you guys are kicking off today to celebrate this launch that you guys have put together of all of these trainers. We've got about 30 seconds. Give us the nuts and bolts. Tell us when and where it will be and what people can expect when they head out. All right, so uh, it will be in Railroad Square at the Craft House. Uh, come out. Um, it's a free event. Uh, we want to invite everybody to come out with great energy, great vibes from uh, all the trainers, the fitness instructors, the Zoom instructors. Uh, just come out and let's have a great time. It sounds like it's going to be a great time. You're going to do some work out there and then you've got the brunch on the back end. So that's going to be awesome for everyone involved. Now, for all of you at home, these guys are going to head over to the craft house right now and they're going to give us a sneak peek of what it looks like inside that event as everybody is getting set up and we start to see all of those trainers and I think about 200 participants, if I'm remembering correctly. That's right. right. At least 200, 8.30 a.m. to 10.30 a.m. There you go. All right, you guys, stay tuned for them in our next hour. You guys, good luck on your way out to that event.